Hello guys, LittleGamer555 here, and I'm here with a new video. My top 5 most recommended Wii games. A lot of these games we got when we first got the Wii, when it came out at launch, so yeah. Number 5. Mario Kart Wii. This game is amazing, without a doubt. The controls are really good. The Grand Prix is fun. I beat every single Grand Prix besides the very last cup, which is the Special Cup, on Mirror Mode, which that's hard as hell, so not recommended for other people. Ow. I just stepped on something. And there's my Wii right here. And but yeah, controls are good, good characters, and I cannot wait for Mario Kart 8 for the Wii U. Number 4, New Super Mario Bros. Wii. The controls are amazing in this. The gameplay is fun in this. The 4 player co cooperative is amazing. The bosses are okay. The castles are fun. The worlds have a very good and imaginative, imaginative levels. This is by far my favorite 2D Mario game ever. I can't, but um, I might be getting a Wii U this year, which I'm probably for sure going to next year. I'm going to be saving up money for one. And I will be getting new Super Mario Brothers Wii U. And I'll be getting it where I could um, record it for you guys. So, I can look forward to my Wii U Let's walkthroughs. So... Great game, pick it up. Now guys, number... Oh, this is number six. This is number four. Okay guys, I guess it's number top six. I kind of did not pick that... It took too many games. Anyways, this is top six games. Then. This is number four. Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. The controls in this game are smooth and fluid. They're very fun. I actually do like this copy more than the um, GameCube version. I don't know why, just something about this is fun. The controls are smooth, fluid, they're nice reacting. The pointer though gets a little annoying because it's a fairing with ring every time you move it around. So yeah. Good story, fun gameplay, badass bosses, great dungeons. I love this game. Pick it up. Zelda fans, adventure action fans, you must have this game. It is amazing. Now guys, now this is number three. Metroid Prime 3 Corruption. I have only played the first one. And that was so many years ago. It was when it first came out I played the first one. And I've only played a demo of the second one. And I've beaten this whole game. This game is amazing. It's a great um, sci-fi um, action game. It is in a first person view, which is a little odd for a Metroid game, but Metroid Prime is my favorite Metroid game ever, and that's um, a first person. But look at, the controls are nice, fluid, good to use, the gameplay is fun, bosses are awesome, the planets are great, very fun, the music it's a metro game. Well, how can the music go wrong? The story is okay. Hyper mode is fun. But the only problem I really do have with this game is the final boss. It, it's it's so sad, man. The final boss. I'm not talking about the Dark Samus. I'm talking about the Aurora, Aurora unit. Dark Samus boss fight is fun. <sighs> you guys are an FPS fan. You have to get this game. If you like sci-fi like Star Wars or like Star Trek, you should get this game. It's fun. It's smooth gameplay. It's fun. It's great. It, and also it's tea. So make sure you're a teenager to buy this game. Just kidding, man. Just pick this game. It's fucking amazing. Now, guys, number two is by far the greatest Mario game of all time. Super Mario Galaxy. I started a walkthrough of this, which I never went back to. 
Um, I'm going to probably start it up again. This game is amazing. The controls are nice, fluid, and fun. The gameplay is amazing. Jumping on enemies never felt so good in a Mario game. Like the gravity basis is so fun. It's a 3D platformer. I love 3D platformers. <sighs> game is amazing. Story is okay. The 120 stars reward is not that the 100 percent of this game like I did. Not that big of a reward. All you get to do is play as Luigi. I felt so violated. I was like, what? How dare you say I only play as Luigi? You know, I that's the whole reason I did it 100 percent Yeah, I even have the Nintendo Selects copy. I thought it came with like a soundtrack like the Zelda Twilight Princess one did, but uh, that's okay. I still it still looks cool. So yeah. You guys like Mario, you like 3D platformers, pick this game up. You're doing yourself a gigantic favor. Now guys, this is by far my second favorite Zelda game of all time. It is for number one. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. This game is fun. Amazing, man. I love this game so much. Now, controls are okay. Like, the only problem I had with it was if you're not sitting where you, exactly where you should be, like if you're off to the side, like, okay. Say TV is the Wii. It's sitting like right here. When my um, middle finger, like right it, like right where right, right, my finger ends. Like, okay, let's see. Right right here where my, I'm pointing is where the TV would be. Then you're sitting right here. The sword will not ro work as good as if you're like sitting like right here. That's the only big problem I have with this game, but the gameplay is pretty fun. The bosses are amazing, and also has my favorite Zelda villain of all time, Gira. Him, he is fucking amazing. He is just so fun. He's crazy. He's amazing. And also, the dungeons in this are so good. Besides the last one, I hate the last one. <laughs> I really do, though. I hate it with a passion. But this game is so fun. The story is great. Link's look is amazing. The graphics are great. I even have a soundtrack that came with this one. This is also this is a good way to celebrate 25 years of Zelda, guys. Really good. You guys don't have it, you're a Zelda fan. Who are you? Who the fuck are you? But yes, guys, this will wraps up my um top ten. I mean, not top, top six most recommended Wii games for you. Now we're just going to show you them all in order. With number one being right here. Number two being right here. Number three being right here. Number four being right here. And number five being right here. And number six being right here. I'm going to show you what it looks like. These guys, all of these games should be pretty cheap nowadays to find. The most expensive one to probably find now is this one. That was the most expensive one to buy in this entire thing. Well, I actually don't think that like this one was. This one should probably this one's probably the almost expensive still. But the rest of these games These are pretty cheap. Like we got my brother, which this technically is his, but now it's mine. He bought this game for about five dollars, I think it was. We got this for free. Not from a store. This, I got this when it first came out and it was only like $20. We got this at launch because this one came with our Wii. I don't know why. This game I got for $20, which I just bought like about five months ago. And this game, I got two years ago, the day it came out. The day this game came out, I got it. And it did not disappoint. So yes, this is the last time. Number one, Zelda Skyward Sword. Number two, Super Mario Galaxy. Number three, Metro Prime 3. Number four, Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Number five, New Super Mario Brothers Wii. And number six, Mario Kart Wii. This is Zelda Gamer 5 for 5 here, guys. And this was my top six most recommended Wii games. See you later.